What is going on guys? This is your boy Albino Raven. And as you can see, basically I've got a warthog um guide coming up for you guys. And I'm kind of showing you right now some of the lakes I go to. Uh, I end up checking some out, finding some new zones. As you can see, I've got that one that's just like completely um I guess blistered whatever you want to call it. It's got purple everywhere. It looks like Barney over there. <laughs> but yeah, so I've got plenty of those. Um, I did want to mention that I have a contest going on right now. And you have to be a member of the Discord, of course, to be participating. But if you want the link to the Discord, you're going to have to tell me because I can't figure out how to make the link permanent. I keep clicking permanent and I keep doing it and then it keeps on not working eventually so i don't know what the deal is with that but it is what it is we're just gonna have to work around it and we'll get it figured out and then it'll be fine so i do believe this guy is one of the better ones that i shoot during this video um he was 48 to 54 i believe something like that and he i mean you know he is the thumbnail so you can <laughs> you can look at this guy and check him out so these two lakes right here, I have a tent placed over here, and the reason I do that is because if you put a tent within 150 meters of the zone, whenever you fast travel there, unless you've already seen those animals, they won't respond. So you have to be 150 meters away from the animal when you fast travel there to make it that way. So, yeah, I got a 97 to 123 kilogram warthog here. He's, I don't remember, he's a decent size. I mean, 40 to 41 to 49. And I've been trying to hunt for respawns, but you know, I've noticed something that there are so many female warthogs and there's really not that many males, it seems like. Like, or they hide super well because I just cannot find no warthogs really. Or I do, but like it's like they're freaking one out of like seven. Like you know what I mean? Like it's it's crazy. I've not found a herd of warthogs. I guess you'd say herd, flock. I don't know, whatever, gang. <laughs> but I mean, I cannot find them to save my life, literally. Um, but I did find some lakes that are really good. This being one of them. Um, this is the lake. If I haven't put the video, or if I haven't shown you in the video. Uh, what lake this is I will show you basically it's pretty much in the middle of the map it's kind of a really long one it's a big long skinny ish lake perfect for um, warthogs pretty good for Ginsbach good for lions I found many there um, this is probably my favorite lake in the whole map it used to be one up in the top northeast of the map but uh, we put a tent there and uh, other stuff and really all I see up there now is Ginsbach. I do see lions every once in a while as well But lion and Ginsbach is pretty much all I get up there now. So For this video, you know the purpose of warthogs I definitely would recommend them the lake that I'm talking about again if it's not in here I'll put it in here and I'll show you guys what it is but yeah, so there's that and Not sure what else we're gonna have going on here. Hmm. <laughs> oh, I did want to ask you guys as well. So I have a few series going on here. I've started this one kind of. It's more of like a guide as, as I get run over by a warthog. Um. So I wanted to know what your guys, I guess, favorite series that I have going on right now is. Um, I haven't done the multi-mount one in a while, but I do want to get back to that one. Um, I can do, like, um, I guess a muzzle loader series, like, you know, like where you hunt with all the different weapons and stuff, you know, just kind of going on with that. I can do, again, the multi-mount. I can do just rares and diamonds, like a, like a guide version kind of abyss. Um, I can do the best of in a month. You know, you guys just let me know what you like because... I'm open for anything, you know, um, especially now that Christmas is over with. I've got more time, finally. Um, so, you know, that's definitely a huge plus is having time because working for FedEx and, you know, 
being during Christmas time, you don't get any time at all. <laughs> so, I finally did. And here we're picking up another warthog again. I didn't, I shot pretty much every male that I could see that I could get to. Because again, you know, like that's pretty much how you get your respawns for diamonds, you know, unless it's like the rabbits or something, which they respawn as diamonds as females. But essentially, that's how I get all my diamonds is um, you shoot every male you can find, and then eventually it respawns a diamond. So that helps. So, yeah. There's that. And, yeah, I ended up seeing that level 5 female, but I don't remember if I shot her or not. I, I don't know, and you guys let me know, because I actually do have a question. Can female lions make diamonds? Because I've never seen a female... Oh, wow, he just popped out of nowhere. <laughs> like, dude, you, sh you really should have stayed hidden for a little bit, and you wouldn't have shown yourself. But I ended up shooting him in the freaking intestines. I can see it now. That was a bad shot. Ugh. That hurts, because that would have given me a really good score on him if they didn't. I mean, not really, really good, but it would have given me a better score than what I had. Or what I ended up getting, but I only hit non-vital on him, so... Of course, it doesn't do too well for me, but, you know, it is what it is. What are you going to do? I could sit here and, you know, Monday quarterback myself, or I could just, you know, deal with it. <laughs> so I think that's what I end up doing, is just... I need to learn to take better shots, but again, I'm not doing this so much for scores as I am. I want respawns because I really, really, really want a diamond warthog. I don't have a diamond wild boar either, but I don't know. I'm just kind of working towards finding that diamond warthog because I really want the one. So they have two horns that I've noticed. I, they might have more, but I've noticed two. One of them is like one that's like more wide. It's like... Um, Almost like a water buffalo's horns, um, except it's their tusks for war um, for warthogs. But the one that like does like a full circle and it's like big and it like almost connects. That's the one I really want because I love the look of that. I like the other one too, yeah. But uh, I just I really really want to get one that has the more circular uh, tusks. I oh, gosh I keep trying to call them horns, but they're not horns. They're tusks, but. You know, I, I don't know. <laughs> so that is one thing I really want to do. And that's pretty much what this was for, was to show you guys, you know, where that is and where you can find them. Because if you guys want one just like that as well, you need to know where you can get your warthogs at. And I'm trying to decide what my next video is going to be. Um, I do have one coming out again this week. i got to find another day to upload, because really all I need to do is just get my... All I've got to do is just get my uploads done and then, you know, go from there because I don't really have to do anything else. To see, So that guy right there, that his horns, that's what I was talking about. I want the other version where they're more rounded in like a circular, which I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about. And you're probably like, dude, shut up. I don't care about what horns you want. <laughs> but in case you actually cared as I rip, I just die right there for no freaking reason. <laughs> Freaking seven warthogs just decided they wanted to charge me at one time, so I got stuck with that. But I ended up going to get him, and I think I hear a kudu. No, that was a war. I mean, not a warthog. A uh, oh, that was a good scoring warthog right there. I forgot about him. Okay, I'm not too mad about that. Wow. But yeah, so you know, again, that's that lake right there. Um. I I'm not sure if I showed you or not. I'm pretty sure I showed you guys where I hunted and what I found. But if not, again, I'll put the the clips or I'll put pictures in the video so that way it shows you where I'm talking about. Because I know that is important. So, you yeah, know, we'll get that taken care of for you guys. Because I know, you know, you guys definitely want to know where it is and, you know. And I've noticed, too, in this game that there's different zones for different people. Like, you know, some people have zones in different areas, which I think is pretty cool, but kind of unusual. At the same time, you know, I, I don't know. I never thought that that would be the case, as I just completely drop him. 
<laughs> he didn't stand a chance, man. <laughs> so that yes, there is that like it's called Zendigilagivi, <laughs> right below an outpost. So yeah, that's where I ended up shooting that guy. So that is the one. Um, and I end up seeing another one apparently. He's only 34 to 42 though, so he's not really going to be that much help. But I mean, I guess any help is, you know, any respawns better than no respawn, right? Because you're not gonna. It's not like they grow in the game, so you have to uh, get them where they do. Whatever you do, you got to make sure you uh, kill them, so that way you actually get a respawn. So yeah, I've got plenty of tents set up and stuff like that over there as well, because that's pretty much how I hunt is hopping from tent to tent on lakes and hunting their drink zones. So again, this is going to wrap this video up, guys. I love you guys. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you for hanging with me through the long dead times of Christmas. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, give me suggestions. What do you guys want to see? What do you guys not want to see? And stuff like that. And I will catch you guys later. Again, if you want the Discord link, make sure you tell me and I'll put it. I'll reply it to you. And be sure you subscribe. I'll talk to you guys later. Follow me on Twitch. Albino Raven. See ya.